The original screen of this iPhone 12 is damaged. It can no longer display normally. Let's replace a new original screen. Step 1. Read the original screen data. Remove the original screen. Power on B1S, B1S, E. Snap the original screen of the phone on the corresponding port of V1S E. Press Read V1S E. E automatically backs up screen data. Step 2. Write the true E-tone data to another replacement original screen. Buckle the new original screen. Write the backed up original screen data. Step 3. Move the Touch IC of the original screen to the new original screen. Install the Touch IC of the original screen to the new original screen. Step 4. Install the screen to check whether the true e-tone is restored. Install the new original screen to the phone. Power on. The true e-tone displays normal. Operation success. Connect the phone to the computer with a data cable. Open JC Repair Assistant. Open the Read Phone interface. Click Trust on the mobile phone. The platform automatically queries the screen SN and MTSN data of the mobile phone. Attention! For iPhone 8 to 11 models, the screen SN and MTSN can be obtained from the mainboard NAN by connecting the phone to JC Repair Assistant or other platforms and the true tone can be restored by writing the code to the screen via JC device. For iPhone 11P to 13PM models, the screen SN and MTSN cannot be obtained directly from the mainboard NAN if the phone has been connected to JC Repair Assistant or other platforms before when it still has its original screen and its original screen SN and MTSN has been backed up to platform before. Then could write the backup data on platform to the new screen to restore the true e-tone. Otherwise, no able to restore with this method. Connect the jailbroken phone to JC Repair Assistant. Enter the Read Phone interface. Unbind. For phones cannot jailbreak. Disassemble the NAND. Put on P13 NAND socket. Connect to JC Repair Assistant. Click iPhone fitting unbind. Unbinding takes 5 to 20 minutes. After unbinding completed. Install the NAND to restore the true e-tone without the original screen. Question 1. The Touch IC of the original screen has been moved to the new screen. What if the data on the original screen cannot be read out? Resolvent. Connect the new original screen to V1S or V1S E. Read the new screen data through the JCID platform. Copy and write the cover code of the Touch IC to the display cover code. Question 2. Why does it pop up when the original Touch IC is moved? Reason. The screen SN has been changed by mistake. Resolvent. Connect the phone to the computer with a data cable. Open JC Repair Assistant and enter the Read Phone interface. Click Trust on your mobile phone. The platform automatically queries the mobile screen SN. Click to copy data automatically. Connect the new original screen to V1S E. Enter the Repair Fitting interface. Read data. After pasting the correct data, write it.